think I prefer the first one in ways to this one now. Yeah, I, I was. I mean, it, it's a bit stupid the way that they didn't really improve this one, the, the way I hoped they would. Because I hoped they they would would have improved this one a little bit more than what they actually have, which wasn't all that much. I guess this is end of the line, really, for the car at least. It's a shame though that they didn't. Hopefully they'll be working on a new one with the improvements that we hoped to see on this one. But they went with the kind of logic of if it's not broken, don't fix it. Except it was kind of yeah. broken. It's I just broke and now there's too many fucking mess ups. Yeah. Guess it wasn't all that great. I mean, the game has a lot of mixed reviews to be honest. But overall it's just an alright zombie game I suppose. Nothing special doesn't really excel in any in any way but seeing that there's such a, a massive range of bad zombie games I guess this one isn't the worst of them can't hurt to look oh and the lack of support on this game as well is ridiculous see this is why I don't press X when I'm next to the guys I just pressed X to uh jump in and crush him. Not only she didn't jump in and crush him, but she kind of got stuck in an animation of doing it, but she didn't do it. And then I was vulnerable and it attacked me and took half my health. And I healed myself. Well, that's, and it that's took different for me, because uh, when I do it, I, I kill him, but then I'm stuck in the animation at the end and then I can get like free hits on me. Exactly, that's what happened to me. But this time I didn't even kill him or anything. It just... I don't think it even damaged him, it just glitched out. Oh, that failed. I'm trying to set him on fire with you. Yeah, I think that'd be a little bit tricky, but... If it works... Oh, shit! Son of a bitch. Oh, he's not dead yet. See, now it's gone all fuzzy again. For fuck's sake. I don't know what it, why or what, how that happens. I don't think this has ever happened to me really, so I, I don't know. Can't really say. But yeah, I would take the radio blur kind of thing away. Fuck you know. <laughs> Her head is all weird. I'll take a screenshot, I guess. Oh god, that was funny though. Oh, what the? Is it is it more here or what's? Why did we come here for? Because you just said that we had to go uh, here. I got a clue. Is it more batteries or what the fuck? Let me check the quests. Uh, quests. Yeah, it's still the same one. Find two electric tables. Okay, I suppose this is part of it, I guess. Oh, there's a floater one here, and an infected. Open a can of whoop ass. Missed motherfucker. Yeah, I'm behind him now. Shanking his fat ass. Oh, and he's down. That's what I'm talking about. Uh, I guess which we, oh, way are we going now? Uh, uh, we gotta go up through here. Through them improvised steps, I suppose. Uh, yeah, I gotta jump down here. Oh, shit. Could have crushed their cunt, but I didn't. Oh well. There's a cable here, but we need something else. Yeah, you can break that door. I never get this fucking breaking animation. On the first try, yeah, it's very hard. I don't, I don't really do. I, do, I don't get it. I don't get what you're actually supposed to do, though. I, I don't know. I guess it's just kind to be a little bit. Uh, Arcadia, I suppose. <gasps> oh shit! What happened? I threw a knife at one of them exploders and I was a bit too yes. close. Oh fucking hell. Did you die? Oh yeah, you're down. I oh, got I didn't got to you in time. I, I didn't know you were down. So I'm right outside anyway. Maybe there's something in Fantastic. here. Fantastic. I've got to do the climbing bit again now. Yeah. Fucking hell, she's getting on my nerves now. I, yeah, I was gonna say, I don't think you're gonna have to get in here anymore because 
we're done with this room, we can just go out. Mainly coming back from my knife anyway. Yeah. Well, that's it. We gotta head back now. <coughs> Let me just check the map real quick. Yeah, we gotta go back to our base. I know, I'll be right back. Okay. I'll get there anyways. Oh, it's right here. Fair enough. I'm back, but I don't know which way you fucking went. You could help me, you it's know. really close, actually. Closer than you think. It's just a little bit in front of you, and then that's it. Fucking There's no zombies when I passed by, so I don't know. If, if I need to go back there, I'll let me know. Uh, I'm just looting stuff around here. I guess. I gotta go upstairs. Is it upstairs? No, it isn't. It's down here, actually. Uh... I'm completely lost. Uh, it's all right. I can go there in a minute. Give me a moment, and I'll electrify those fences. This is for you. I think on our way Ooh, to lighting mod. So you got a new mod, mm. which is lighting. Where are you? Oh, you're that way. Uh, I got a clue. It's all right. I'll go to. Oh, I can see the fences already. All the electrified. This is good stuff, man. Yep, they're all the way I'm coming to you now because you're close by. It's really close to here. Um, okay. I'm back on like uh, the pathway where that car was. Let me check the map. Yeah, you went a little bit further away to a direction which is different, I suppose. Yeah, keep going that way and then turn right as soon as there's a cross section. This way. Uh, hold on. Yeah, that way. Turn right again. Uh, oh cool. This is the end of the road. Then get off the car and just go on foot because you're right close. You're right there. If you just turn right now. Do you know that? Yeah, uh, in front there. Do you know that? What, yeah, do you know that bloke who wanted the fuel? Yeah. Yeah, I'm boy there. Yeah, just turn right from where you are. Uh, yeah. there ain't no right turn now. Uh, yeah, keep going straight. And then, as I can see, you, you gotta go kind of back. Oh, then... fuck. Okay, see if I can meet you halfway. Because it's really quite close, but... It, it just keep going around circles because it's so hard to, to get where it Don't is. Well, I could barely see oh. either, so it's making it harder. There you are. You're right there. It's this way now. Uh, how do I get up there? Oh. You climb the, through the rock and then jump from the other side. <laughs> Can't hurt to look. There you are. all the fences now yeah how'd you get in now uh, you just press x on one of the fences like this and then you get in and then you, you put the fence once you're in on yeah there we are check the quests yeah. yeah we're back to the main quest again uh i think i'm gonna leave I've it here for now because it's works. pissing me off okay much time already. keeps going funny yeah i got another five minutes on this video so i might as well just I don't know. Check out the quests. Pump action. Um, hmm. Let's see. Find the mud oh, pump. Oh, fuck it, I mean, uh, what I mean. I was a throwing knife. I was, I was a fucking oh, it just exploded. I was looking at the map as well. And the shit just blew up. Um, 
increase bleeding and poison damage. Why not? Well, I'm gonna uh, cut this uh, video here. Yeah? So I'll see you then. Okay. Increases poison duration. I don't have really anything poisonous. So I don't know if I want to use that. But I do want enough skill so I can unlock this last one. Which I only got one more to use. Um, okay. Guess I'll use that one there, I suppose. And then I don't know how many until I can unlock that. Right, uh, oh. got another five minutes to this video, so I might as well explain this. Um, if you go to the team kind of page, you can see your whole team. You can see uh, Gaming Reaper, for example, which is my co op. And if we had any, all the full party, we'd have Sampi, Perna, and John. Uh, so if we had yeah. the full party, we'd have all of them. But because we don't, we only are two of us. You can only see the individual status on, you know, the two of us. Now on the other ones that are uh, that are not players, that are the the NPCs. As you can see, you can start quests on them. So every single survivor on your camp, there's uh, at least three quests each. Now each one of the quests that that you give basically increases their base strengths. Right now. For example, if I go to the Sambi quest, uh, his current weapon is a mace. Now if I press Y for details, you, you can see the details of the survivor. If I start the quest, uh, it, there you go, you can see uh, upping the odds with Sambi. So the first one is kind of easy. For example, if I do this quest right now, uh, I get five deodorant bombs and a grenade. Um, I'd get no XP out of it, but basically each of the characters is gonna uh, require you to do something special for them for like for example Sambi uh, wants deodorant bombs so if you've got five of them that you can give him he'll increase his base strength it basically makes uh, other NPC characters level up uh, I'm gonna check out some of these because I might have the required materials to make them level up even if only for a bit so I'm gonna start this one with Sambi and let's go ahead and start this one with Perna John, I'm gonna start with all of the survivors around because as soon okay, this we can't start with this one, but I can with Harlow. Uh, she's not in, and it says at the bottom if they are immune or not immune. Uh, most of them are obviously are not gonna be immune, sadly. Um, so I need five grenades to, for that colonel, and yeah, basically just increase the character. So you can increase the base camp defenses, as you saw, guys saw, we made we increased the uh. We put the electrified fences, so we increase the fence size. I don't have enough for either of them, actually. Uh, we, we have increased the uh, base camp strength. Uh, you can increase the characters as well. As, you know, their weapons, their base attributes and stuff like that. Oh, but I do have a gas lighter for this guy. Alright, so I, I just finished well, this guy. Uh, I'm just gonna log out here then, tell me. Alright, alright. Um, alright, so bit. All right. So as you guys saw, I just gave him, uh, Some vacation has turned out to be you know, whatever items he needed. And he's gonna give me the reward, which is a Sonic Pulse Grenade, which I just got. And his base status are not gonna increase. As you can see, he's now increased by one. So this is basically... Uh, oh, I got enough for this one as well. And now I can use storage with this guy because I've used that. Now, because I'm doing this, Gaming Reaper will also, be, uh, you know, get his benefits out of this. So only one person really has to do this on your own, and yeah, that's pretty much it. So whatever I'm not particularly using right now, I'm going to deposit in there. Um, actually, I could use this revolver right now, so I'm going to keep it. Uh, I'll put this nail gun back. back. Alright, I'll put this nail gun back and do some, put the flare gun away as well. Also, you, you can throw the, the, the flares. But, as you guys can see, uh, you pr supposedly use the flares on the flare gun, but you can use the flares uh, on their own as well, like uh, Reaper was trying to do uh, before. Uh, it doesn't really kill anyone with the flares, but they are there and they are usable, I suppose. I got 21 flares right now. 5 Molotovs, Poison Mine I'll put away for now. Because I am honestly not seeing myself using any, any mines or anything like that. Uh, Sonic Pulse Grenade, I suppose. And every time I do something, this just gets me up, which is a bit annoying, to be quite honest, but whatever. Um, yeah, I guess I'll just put that there as well. I only got three grenades, which is not all that great. I think I need five to unlock the other dude, but whatever. 
uh, 30 alcohol definitely will go because it's just too much and it's taking a lot of space. But yeah, I'll do this off camera, guys, I suppose. And I'll see you guys in the next chapter. <laughs>